coming to the stage now. No one cares. Jose, uh, good job, man. First time. You know, so. I, I'm not a stand-up comedian. I've been coming here for like a month, just getting into it. Um, I'm very nervous with uh, public speaking uh, and uh, trying to make people laugh. You know, it's a, it's a genuine thing. So good job. Uh, just keep coming back. No hard feelings. If you want to leave and go train at another place, you can do that. <laughs> I wouldn't recommend staying for my TED Talks, uh, <laughs> Toastmasters TED Talks that I have to practice. I paid the guy twelve dollars for twenty minutes, so I'm gonna <laughs> are you gonna heckle me, young lady? A little bit. Okay, no coughing. The traffic's gonna be there all night. Okay. You guys have heard all my A-game material, but so uh, let's do something different. If you have a question, ask it. What's your family like? I have, oh, okay, introduction. Uh, Aloha everyone, uh, my name is Overweight Oprah Winfrey uh, from uh, <laughs> Maui, Hawaii. Uh, born in Silverton, Oregon, raised in Maui, Hawaii all my life. Did some uh, some negative things, got arrested. The judge said jail or military, chose military. Did uh, clean toilets for eight years with my tongue. Got out, tried to become a police officer and firefighter, didn't work out. Tried meth once, didn't like it. Then I decided to become a wannabe stand-up comedian. <laughs> uh, I do have uh, two younger brothers, both with disabilities. Uh, the first one has a Tourette syndrome and OCD. The second one's a drunk. Uh, I am a single father of two boys that have on Craigslist. <laughs> uh, so my family, it's uh, I, I feel I come from a hardship just in this lifetime. I got the experience of having a brother, another time out for the motorcycle. Please don't heckle me. Time in. Uh, the uh, two younger brothers uh, having another human organism in this lifetime who has defects, the neurons in his brain. You know, a lot of people with disabilities don't have uh, proper functioning like the rest of us normies. And uh, it's just been hard to watch him get picked on uh, in this lifetime. And uh, a, lot of, a lot of things that I have to see my mom go through as a single mother of three kids. Uh, one with disabilities, uh, fighting like the Department of Education in the state of Hawaii. Uh, that was kind of a difficult thing as I grew up understanding the uh, bureaucracy behind education with people with disabilities. And uh, so whatever challenge it, it lies, uh, you know, I've had the, uh, and this, it's a challenge, it's a challenge of my life. And uh, I don't know, I guess that's what kind of compels me or feel, makes me feel entitled or compelled to try and make people laugh uh, through, through whatever positive energy that we're trying to do uh, here in this career, this mindset, this ideology of becoming a stand-up comedian. I paid for 10, bro. <laughs> I'm doing, I, I gotta practice a half an hour until Flappy's Comic Club starts their uh, open mic set. So if you wanna leave, you can leave, but I'm gonna stay here and indulge in my narcissism because I'm a, the funniest open mic here in North Korea and uh, trademark. Does that answer your question? Next question. What's your favorite thing to do? 
Six. Next question. Why did you? Why did you? No more questions. Thank you very much. <laughs>